Our application is essentially an array of a randomly generated amount of turtle objects. The array of turtles are spread across the screen using another method. We use onKey methods for the user inputs. The handlers are mapped to a method that hides the turtles on the screen. The game ends when there are no turtles left on the screen. It's name game time, it's gonna be fun. It's you and the computer. Whoever picks the last turtle wins. Press 1 to pick 1 turtle, 2 for 2 turtles, and 3 for 3 turtles. Choose wisely. Let's do it. My partner and I built this application because we both enjoyed the assignment in class. We've both learned a lot since the first time we worked on NIM and we felt like we could add to the game by making it more interactive by incorporating a GUI and visual feedback for the user. NIM is a particularly interesting game because it's an impartial game. Uh, that means there cannot be a tie in NIM. It is a two player game and as math people we like to find winning strategies and we really like NIM for its contributions to combinatorial game theory. By taking on the task of writing the game of NIM we can more easily see the logic of the game and find a winning strategy. Initially we intended to use a clickable user interface for the user to make the selection of turtles that they wish to be removed from the screen. This proved too challenging however because we would have had to have kept track of all the turtles x and y coordinates as well as implement the onclick methods and find a way to transition from the player's turn to the computer's turn once three turtles have been removed.